Okay guys, just a quick little video here to introduce this new uh, amplifier board that I found. Um, this is a KRC-86B Bluetooth module and I've got this thing hooked into um, a little uh, PAM 8403 amplifier here. <clears throat> now the nice thing about this um, about this Bluetooth board is that uh, it has an external input so we can go ahead and add a, a jack on it. Uh, it's got a LED pairing light um, and because you're coming out of here and going into a, a separate amplifier you can go ahead and um, put a, a resistor network so that you can get a mono signal coming into uh, your amplifier. Um, this thing seems to be very low noise. Uh, I've got it turned on right now and uh, as you can see I don't have an isolation transformer in here uh, and this thing is not putting out any noise whatsoever. But probably the most um, the most uh, important thing that I'm finding is that, look at this, look at that quiescent current. We are only drawing 20 milliamps at 5 volts. That's amazing. So let me go ahead and throw on some uh, royalty free classical music and we'll see what happens here. Okay, even at full volume, this thing is only drawing about 50 milliamps. Let me go ahead and put something that has a little more bass on it and uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, even distorting this little uh, this little speaker here, we're still pulling less than uh, 200 milliamps. So I think this is my new best friend. Um, this is low current, low noise. It allow me to um, to mess with the signal. I'll either put this in mono or put a volume knob in between the uh, the Bluetooth receiver and amplifier and will allow me to pair this to uh, pretty much any amplifier I like. Um, you know, up to this point I was using these stick ones, um, you know, these stick Bluetooth receivers with the uh, Murata isolation DC to DC uh, transformer. Um, but this thing looks like it might be um, a little cleaner setup. Um, you know, obviously if I'm using a 12 volt amp, I can use, still use a Murata isolation transformer, you know, to bring the voltage down from 12 volts to 5 volts to drive this thing. Um, and still within, well within the 1 watt limitation of those Murata transformers. So I hope you found this interesting, and uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>